Hi, I'm Mark, coming to you from Baker's Green Acres. Our Anyone Can Farm question today comes from Susie out of Ohio. And it is a milk cow question, and I'm assuming from the rest of the email that it was, uh, she was talking about a family milk cow, not, not like creating a herd. And uh, we're big advocates of the family milk cow around here. Uh, this is Rosie. She's one of our best girls. Uh, she's about three years old. Here, why don't you get your head up there so we can see you? She's camera shy. And uh, let's see, she's given us two calves. Uh, very good girl. So the first question is, what type of cow should I get? It depends where you live, what's available, but if you can find a jersey, I don't think you can go wrong. They have a sweet temperament. They're like uh, a pet, um, and they'll be with you for 20 years. So they become part of your family, and what better animal can you have than a lovable, wonderful cow like this that will give you uh, between two and five gallons of milk a day. You know, that's a lot of milk, and that's a, a whole lot of sustenance. You can do a lot with that. So a great animal. She will eat about a half a bale of hay a day. Hay right now is going for six bucks, so you're talking three bucks a day to feed her when you have to feed her hay. In this summertime, we don't feed them at all. They're out on pasture. And a cow like this, um, you can tether her out, and she'll just eat alongside the road or alongside a fence row or whatever like that. There's plenty of good stuff for her to eat. All right, how old a cow should I get? Well, they have to have at least have calved once, had one baby, and that starts the whole lactation process. So you'd have to get one from about two years old to 15 years old, I say. These cows will live 15 to 18 years old. Okay, so, or even 20, or even 20 if you take really good care of them, you don't push them too hard. Um, so it's right, at, right in there, I think the most important thing you want to look for is temperament in the animal. If they're nice and your kids can be around them and sit on their back and they're not aggressive, that's what you want. And we don't really see that in, in um, Jersey cows, right? Bulls, different story. We'll talk about bulls another day. Do I need any equip equipment for milking? Oh, I, that wasn't supposed to happen. Well, this is Penny. She wants to get in on the end here. Do you need any equipment for milking? Uh, the key word there is need. You don't need it, but it sure makes life a lot easier. We milk two cows right now, and we can milk them in about 10 minutes with uh, a surge milker. And uh, if you are more interested in that, you can check out our class or I plan to do a video on that, an in-depth video that will uh, try and show all the as aspects of owning a family milk cow, the ins and outs of it and just the, the sheer joy of it. They're great animals, just great animals. Can you imagine taking your lawnmower and making a boat anchor out of it and uh, getting a little portable fence and put it around your yard so you don't have to do any mowing in the summertime. Well, that's what we do. I do do some mowing, but these guys take care of the rest. Why mow it and just spend all that time and energy on it when uh, these girls can go out and mow it and then uh, turn it into milk for the table? And if you haven't had fresh cow's milk, raw cow's milk, you really you need, you need to do that because that's one of those things should be in your bucket list. And it's very good for you. It cures a lot of problems that human beings have. All right, I uh, just want to remind you, we have 28 days left in our Indiegogo fundraising campaign. And um, if you haven't checked into that, please go to anyonecanfarm.com. That's money that we're raising to put into the infrastructure for our farm program here, our uh, educational program, three-day classes that will start Friday, uh, Saturday, and Sunday. And these classes start on the 11th of May with a pastured poultry class. And you can check the schedule to see if there's anything you'd like. Remember, anyone can farm. Hope you do. Have a good weekend.